launch octopus time. Put it da da put it up. I love the little animation here. Oh no, it's when he's okay. It's later. It's when you actually fight him. I was confuzzled. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Now, launch octopus is uh, stage music. I like it, just like I like pretty much every other song in this game. But it just isn't that memorable, in my opinion. Whatever. Alright, we'll just skip a lot of the stage here. Er, not, not much. Okay, these seahorses are annoying. There's tons of mini-bosses in this stage, too. Such as this one. I'd recommend getting rid of that little, like, searchlight kind of thing. You actually do fight this boss twice. And its other form is a lot more annoying when it comes back. Trust me. Um, it's actually coming up soon here. And those fish will basically just suck you into their mouths. Um, but they don't hurt you unless you, like, stay in there for a while, so. And actually, I think we have the, yep, second mini boss. Again, shoot up the, oh, that was close. Yeah, this time there's spikes, so it's a lot harder. But yeah, jump over it instead of dashing, because if you dash, I assure you, you will land in the spikes and die. Like that. Ugh, whatever. Wow, I think that's the first time I've died, actually. I was hoping I could go through here without dying, but oh well. Screw it, I'll just shoot the body. Yeah, actually, if you're okay with taking damage, you can just stand right next to it. Oh, I hate you. Don't try to shoot it at all when it's doing that. There we go. Wow, he's a dick. Okay. And actually, there's an upgrade coming up. And I recommend using Storm Eagle's weapon because it makes it a little bit easier. Because it kills this boat in one hit. Just kill the boat. It breaks through this ground here. And we have another mini-boss. Actually, we fight this guy later on, too. kind of reminds me of the uh, one boss in Twilight Princess that you have to like jump on its back and stab its eye out. But yeah, just jump on its back. You can hit its tail too. But yeah, there we go. It's dead. And don't land in the spikes. Holy crap. That's the one part about riding on its back that is kind of hard. And then this heart tank. We only have one more, which just involves going back to Sting Chameleon stage. Alright. Go back up here. And actually, we have to fight that thing again. Except there's no spikes, so it's all good. And I forgot where he appears. Right here, okay. And if you're getting hurt by him as he's coming up, you can actually glitch through him and jump on his back. Oh, I hate you. Wow, you suck. Hey, he's dead. Yeah, at this point, always grab extra health power-ups, even though your health bar is full, because they'll fill up your uh, sub-tanks. Even though there's an easy place to do that right before the final boss, I will show that, but... Anyway, let's go fight Launch Octopus. His weakness is Armored Armadillo's weapon, and I'd highly recommend using it if you're not going for a no-power run. Because he's a pain without it. Yeah, he's like, you're going down! I love that animation. Anyways. This is why Armor's Ar Armored Armadillo's weapon is a little bit hard to aim with, because it just kind of rolls around. Plus... Uh, if it hits these, like, missiles that he shoots at you, it doesn't hit him at all. The secondary fire on this is actually very good, too. Okay, stay away from that, because he will just suck your health and it would actually heal him. So yeah, stay out of that vortex. And sometimes he'll do it a lot like this, just constantly. 
he does a lot of damage too if you don't have the shield or the armor upgrade there we go okay you're dead he's kind of a dick it's okay though do 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 bum bum and we get the homing missile Okay, now let's just go grab that power up and sting chameleon stage that we still need. Another thing about the Hadouken, you need all the upgrades first. So you need all the sub tanks, all the heart tanks, all that stuff. We found Sigma's fortress. Let's go in and put an end to his war against the humans. Alright, again, going to sting chameleon really quick. I'll be right back when we get there. Okay, once you get to this spot that I pointed out before, go down here and use your helmet upgrade to break through these with your feet, which totally makes sense, right? And as you can tell, this area wouldn't have been filled with water before, but since we beat Launch Octopus' stage first, we can go back here and get it. Anyways, let's use the escape thing. Escape. And next time we will do the Sigma stages, or start them anyway. Come on. Okay. Alright, I'll see you guys next time.